Okay, today I'm going to show you how to install this Watco product that um, basically gives you a twist turn uh, stopper with a screen in it to prevent all that hair from getting down the drain in the first place. So you're less likely to have a backed up drain and it's going to be easier to clean up all the hair. So first I remove the old stopper, then I measure and make sure that it is the right size. It comes with a ruler at the bottom as you can see. We're right in where we should be. So here's the stopper. Just a little screen. I have a little attractive chrome plated. It's got the little push pull stopper. Also comes with its own silicone. So I mean this is really a toolless application. In order to get that silicone to stick, I want to make sure there's no dirt, debris, or water. No, no loose dirt. No hair in there or anything like that. You want to make sure it's nice and dry. I'm just using toilet paper, which isn't the best thing in the world to wipe up water with, but I was in the bathroom and it was close by. So now that I got that all set, I'm going to go ahead and put a liberal amount of that uh, caulking down just around that comb flange. It's not the best tube that they give you, but it works. And I actually use a little bit more than I probably should have, but it all works out. There we go. Now it's just a matter of pressing the old piece in place and doing a little bit of cleanup. So I squeeze it or put a lot of pressure on it. Then I'm going to clean up that excess caulking that came out the outer edge. Hold the screen down basically while I pull up the plunger. And off camera, you'll, you'll see right here, there's a little bit that was stuck to it. And then off camera, I clean that little bit, those little dots of caulking. I clean that out. Thanks for watching. Click thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you so much.